Hello, the Brook here with more Gunsly Lower League Management save, and yeah, and it's actually been a pretty good month <laughs> to say so for being a bottom team. We still lose some, but I feel like we at least had some luck here in the end, and we got the seven points we needed to stay off uh, or for me to still be in the team so that's nice I did not get sacked here but today's game will be against Braintree uh, yeah I thought why not since uh, then we have just done the whole month so yeah Stanley ah oh, really oh. Uh, Robinson Stanley uh. Brother, May Brownlee, oh, terrible defending there, really terrible. Uh, can we get some goal there, boys? Mm, really? Now, when we get a freaking chance, we miss it, of course. A freaking course. And let me guess, another goal, yeah. Fucking bullshit. A yellow card so far, and we are not that far in the game. Oh, great. What are you freaking doing, goal keeper? There, we have played pretty good here, but still, it's one of those things that should not happen. And we score, and the hole. Too bad that our defense is so awful. Uh, oh, really, Thompson? Why do you do that? That is just pathetic. Oh, still, I feel like. How much unlock can you have in this fucking game? Well, working Gunsley 2 1. Ooh! Ball! Yes! We lead here! Oh, please. Oh, even that. Boys! Ooh! Gus! 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 Gunsley. Oh no, no, no. Of course. Fucking corners. Christ, no. Not the fucking fucking corners. I fucking hate them. <sighs> really, fucking such a fucking robbery. Well, there you go. Gunsley Tramir two two, and uh, not fair at all. And we should have won this. You were freaking robbed here. Thompson, can you get a? Ooh -ho! Yes! Oh, nice. Acting hat. We're actually ninth, I believe, in the league. Griffiths. Hatfield. Brownhill. Osborne! Oh my god! <laughs> 70 minutes and we lead at Atteringham away. What is this madness? What is this madness? Very pleased here. Osborne. Uh, boys, he's actually not done that many goals recently. Griffiths, Brooksby, good pass there, and... Oh, what is this madness? Played awesome right now. Uh, boys, Osborne. Oh my god, boys! Mm. Honestly, 0-4. Uh, can we... Mm, mm. No, no, no. Oh, of course. Okay, Atringham, Gunsley, 1-4. My god, amazing result. Okay, so we are back here. So first we might actually check this screen because we have made two new transfers here and we have actually, he's out on loan but well, uh, who cares about that, that is a uh, young play. So yeah, we got Matthew Barlett here. He doesn't look that much to the world, but he could be decent. Uh, he has decent potential I guess and I did not really I mean he did not cost anything in uh, wages so I still thought why not uh, so he will play in our reserve team for now the one that I was really pleased to get was this uh, Nor Northern Ireland guy uh, Engelhan Mac McNeil whatever McKeel uh, he's actually pretty decent. Uh, he's pretty. Uh, 
okay fitness levels, okay uh, physical, almost is like a, uh, uh, what is it called, defensive mid, so well, I actually played one cap, uh, one under 21 cap and wa scored one goal, so that's pretty nice, so yeah, he actually was uh, from hole before, so feel like he could be actually decent. He had not played a match from start, but he's still, he's still been decent. Uh, oh yeah, fitness coaching, yeah, I know that is a problem. So yeah, as you would see, we won against Actung Sham, which would have been the live match, match but oh well. Uh, this was a little bit sad, since that match was so freaking good. It was the best match of the season and was away, so... Awesome there, but we will do our best today against Braintree. I love that name of a game, of uh, a team. I might just ta uh, uh, coach them some day because their name. Uh, so yeah, you can tell me if you have coached them. So Andy Hall has done a great. I believe he's the best player. No, uh, or he has actually not played anything. So. Uh, Morton has been decent, but he's not played that much either. So, Hall has been the best player here, and Holland has not either played that much, uh, just in the reserve. And Osborne, really happy with Osborne. Osborne has been one of the best players, actually. He, he's played his part into the starting lineup, so that's pretty nice. So, he, I mean, he's pretty young as well. Uh, this is uh, physical is not a great, but his uh, uh, technical and mental is really good uh, for this level, and so yeah, this is awesome. Uh, one with thirteen goals and one with ten goals and one with nine goals, so that's pretty nice. Uh, Kradok is unfortunately uh, still injured. Oh, oh great! He was. I did not even see this until right now. Uh, yeah, he's been pretty injured, unfortunately. Uh, so yeah, that is a little bit sad. And who? Uh, yeah, so I feel like we should still be able to and uh, not get relegated just because we have so many goal scorers here, or we have like three persons that score like up to 10 goals, but still we are under the relegation zone or whatever. Okay, we are back. I'm sorry about that uh, interruption or whatever. And yeah, we have Sack Thompson. It's, oh yeah, I uh, imported uh, one of these squads from a YouTuber here, but oh well. Six assists. I still want to him to sign for new year, but I feel like we will not get that. He's just such a good player. He's like too good for this <laughs> league almost. So unfortunately, we probably will not get him. Uh, Brooksby as well. Six Brooksby we have for another year, so that's nice. Brooksby and Rotary we have for another year, and then we have Hatfield there. That's brilliant as well. He's pretty young, so that's pretty nice with most of these players. Oh, Rotary is 28, but still not that bad. So yeah, I guess let's go into the, today's game. Uh, so yeah, the tactic change here, which hasn't been that huge or whatever, we just put put one here. Oh well, <laughs> yeah, talking about that guy, we, uh, I don't know why this, I think I did put something and it made it so it was that, I don't, I don't know what it was really. Uh, okay, brain tree, who's the main guy here, Yusuf. 14 goals and Isaac 10 assist. Oh my god. Okay. But we won against Alter Shem, so who knows? We might actually at least get a point here. I would be glad with a point. Uh, but even if we won the last game with 4 1, we are still down there at the uh, bottom of the table or whatever. So, yeah. 
he still need uh, lots of points. I, f I feel like the bottom team has actually not been that bad this year. I'm sorry about that. It's just so many interruptions here. But well, Isaac. Oh, that player was dangerous. Oh, Griffiths. <laughs> oh, nice that you did not get the yellow card there. Boys. Oh, no. Ooh. Yes, Osborne. Uh, offside. Um, boys there. Well, one point is it's still a home game, so three points would be awesome, but one point is also good. All the points we can get. All the points that we can get. That is just the thing right now. Oh, uh, really? This was a really uninteresting game, it seems like. Uh, on our stats, it does look like we are that bad. Just has not really happened anything. That is just the thing here. Yeah, it seems like a defense actually has been better recent games. I don't know if it's just my feeling or if it's actually true. Uh, I mean, we just got one goal against us in the recent game, so that was nice. Uh, I don't really know if we can do any changes. James Boyd, I guess Kyle Brownhill has been pretty bad, and both Brownhill and where is the other guy? Um, Boyd actually has uh, contract expired, so we might try to get them in if we can, uh, but I guess we will see. So I don't really know what we will do here actually. Uh, let's actually check the pros on stats uh, Yes, because uh, I have no idea what is going on <laughs> Oh key passes there we go uh, Number four and yeah number four, but I believe that play plays pretty low down and Crosses they have not really completed that many 11 and 9 Let's see here. Number four is still Isaac, but uh, I really don't know if I can do that much more. Who else was it? Ah, oh, can't remember. Number 12 as well. Well, uh, I still feel like we have done a good job against these guys, so I don't really know what to do. Um, closing down. I guess we could close down a little bit more. Or. Uh, I do not know because I feel like if we close down too much we might lose the ball and such so yeah I, don't, I do not know really uh, let's try that one uh, retain posi uh, positioning let's see how that turns out I have not really seen too much of them but I have not seen too much of us either so it's kind of hard to analyze this game so far uh, when nothing really has happened and it is kind of a really poor game actually let's actually do a switch here and see if we something can happen here if we do a switch eh. Kyle Brownhill mm. This is uh, uh, unfortunate stuff. Uh, can hold play there. Oh well. Hopefully it doesn't do an awful game. <laughs> Let's hope for that. Uh, Morton has looks pretty. It actually looked g uh, good in the friendlies he we have played. So who knows? He might actually score. Um, Braintree is what was they six eight in the league. So. Still not that bad. Uh, oh, we have a chance here, but oh well. Uh, or no, maybe they have a chance. Oh well. Uh, let's see. Can we do any switches here? Uh, the defense has done it really good this game against the really strong teams. I feel like we have done a good job here. Uh, Hatfield, maybe, or Osmore. Actually, I want to see one thing here, and that is when our next game is. Oh, she was there. Eh, this is a little bit disappointing. Oh well, 
then we might actually take out Osborne here instead and take you inside there. So yeah. And there will be a last substitution. Isaac, uh, can we? No, no. We have done it so good so far, guys. Just keep uh, going on this. Oh, we get the last chance, but no. Uh, so sorry there. I really poor live match actually against uh, Braintree but we at least got the point so I'm actually happy with the performance we did today we actually really keep it very solid today uh, which I'm kind of surprised of we are not the team that are really all about subtlety in defensive areas or whatever to say so we got one point here we are 33 points uh, unfortunately the other teams have not played that many but oh uh, yeah 33 and uh, let's actually check the table even if it's kind of hard to read right now when it's kind of not uh, 11 matches still left but as you can see at least we in the free recent game we have actually taken uh uh, points so we have taken five points on the recent games. I feel like uh, That is a problem. Aldershot is in great form uh, Shatterham is in pretty good form as well Whole effects is not in that great form and welling so they might actually slip down some position but 40 and 39 is pretty good still uh, 33 um, Yeah, I would like to get a little bit more uh, three points here and um, they were really about to go up here but uh, now they lost the game again uh, Lincoln ha have one game well uh, yeah it's uh, it's four points still so there's this is not the greatest that is four points but we're doing what we can at the moment I feel like so and if we get relegated, we get relegated. But I feel like still we are doing as good as we can. As, and as you saw, we did actually a pretty good game against uh, Braintree here. So at least hope, uh, as you can see, we have gotten some points. And working actually, that game we should have freaking got one point. So I feel, I feel like I got robbed in that game, basically. I believe I did even say that in the live commentary so well uh, which will be a next game I see a one two three four five four and uh, South Ham uh, Southport could actually be a cool game to live come because that's a really important game that is a six point game and as well I hope I can get points against uh, Bromley because they've not been that great and maybe even points against Dover, who knows, we actually got a draw there in the other game um, and Kinmanster draw as well, so who knows, and I mean we have not lost uh, um, the recent uh, uh, free game, so who knows, we might actually take a point in the next game as well. Uh, I would still be very happy for that. Kid Minister is ninth in the league, but I mean, we won against Atring Sham, so who knows? We might actually take a point, and then as you can see, we actually in the recent game only conceded uh, one goal and three goals in three matches. Like, super superb but it's still still decent to just uh, concede three goals on three matches I mean it's not like we met uh, Tremere decent side maybe not the best but uh, Ettringham uh, they are 11th in the league yeah it's nice we are meeting some of these teams but Braintree my god Braintree is almost at at the playoff spot so 
Yeah, we actually did a good game. And Wooking as well. We did a good game there as well. So I feel like we really can disturb this team at the top, which is uh, really nice, actually. I don't know. I feel like we have more problem with the lower uh, teams when we really have to... Uh, yeah, when we are favorites, so to speak, or whatever. So, yeah. Uh, so, thank you all for watching. Uh, as I said, we will be back in the game against Southport. Or maybe Chester? I, I guess I will see how it turns out. So, we have 33 points. So, uh, to say we need like 13 points, maybe more, uh, on 11 matches. Well, it will be tough, but who knows? Uh, I still hope that we can peak our form or whatever to say. Uh, and that I can stay still uh, in the team. And then we just have these... Ma and then we don't have that many matches left. So, yeah, thank you all for watching. Have a good tea and a good coffee day. And i see you soon again. So, bye!